What is going on guys? Nick Ross here, Body of Legends, and we are bringing back some old school stuff. Uh, the training with the um, commentary, I haven't done it in a while, quite a minute. But, um, you know, we're back at it. I need to apologize for my absence. You know, I mean, I, you know, I'm, I'm uploading videos, but I'm not as frequent as I usually am. Uh, but, I mean, I'm back, guys. Back with vengeance. <laughs> so, we're getting in a good back session here. Now, my priority right now is not really on strength or reps, but it's just to increase my work capacity. Now, what I mean by my work capacity is that, let's say, you know, the uh, typical workout for me would be like an hour or an hour and 15 minutes. Now, I'm trying to extend the length of time that I work out, which is now two hours, and I want my intensity to be consistent throughout the entire two hours of me training. So, the same level of intensity and drive that I had set one, I should have at the very last set of the workout and that's pretty difficult to do but that's what i've been aiming for and thus it's going to help me you know expend um more energy i'm able to you know put my body under far more stress you know it's so stressful on the body to train like this but you know you're going to adapt very fast and adapting fast of course is going to correlate with faster muscle growth um, you know, so definitely playing around with, uh, you know, tempos and, you know, drop sets, supersets, tri-sets, giant sets, you know, definitely trying to see what style of training best fits me. And I think I found it. I really do. You know, I think just, you know, completely hammering my body with reps and reps and reps with a moderate weight definitely is where I need to be. You know, I mean, I could deadlift you know easily you know 500 515 right now but you know keeping it you know kind of lighter and making sure the quality is there and i don't want to burn myself out too too fast because like i said this is an extended workout you know about two hours and if i want to maintain that level of consistency and intensity for the entire length of the time of trading then i kind of have to pace myself a little bit um you know so i have to be more mindful of you know don't just go for heavy 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 weight but you know just go for the quality of the reps um you know get some heavy weight in yes you need the heavy weight to build the thickness but you know the priority is to you know just put the body under um you know stress you know a longer length of time under stress and that's going to come in the form of me working out longer and um you know being very consistent with my sets and i've been doing that for the past couple weeks and um, it's kind of funny what's happening to my body because my weight on the scale is going up right now. I'm 199 and I'm the heaviest I've ever been being this lean. You know, I'm actually, you know, I, I kind of want to say I'm losing fat and, you know, the scale is going up. So I'm not going to say I'm burning fat and building muscle because it's going to create a bunch of controversy. But, you know, the scale is looking pretty nice and the mirror is looking pretty nice. Um, you know, with this type of work training as well, you know, my food volume is through the roof. You know, I've never consume so much food in my life you know i'm talking about clean food of course but i'm talking about you know let's say first thing in the morning we're going to do uh two cups of oats and um 10 egg whites you know and uh, after that you know probably another two cups of rice and you know like eight ounces of fish i mean it's a lot of volume when you think about it you know two cups of rice that's a lot of freaking carbs that's a lot to eat in one sitting and i'm having that type of meal six times a day so training is through the roof uh, work capacity is very, very, very high. Food volume is very, very high as well. So I'm just increasing everything. And, um, you know, for the past couple weeks, I've been training like this. And I've noticed so much of a difference in my physique, man. Like, you know, my physique, the amount of weight I can lift, you know, everything is just going sky high. You know, you can see the photos on Instagram. If you don't follow me on Instagram, then you're missing out. Body of Legends at Instagram, guys. Post some photos and you can definitely see the changes that are happening week by week. So thank you guys for keeping up with the progress. Thank you guys for subscribing to the channel. Thank you for always <laughs> uh, being there and, um, you know, keeping up with me. So, you know, this is a journey. We're having fun with this. And uh, I'm excited, guys. Very excited for the future. So Nick Ross, guys, Body of Legends. See you next time. Bye-bye.